What's up everyone, it's Dolvik, today for a new world video, I was with my alt in Lilith and people speak about other server because now Lilith is merging into Maramo, so I was like, am I transferring or am I have three characters on Maramo, but no, I decided to go on Valhalla since the people said that it, it was one of the highest pop server and the PvP was popping, so you can see my first clip I in Valhalla I seems like I can 1v2 almost everyone no challenge look at this PvP this is insane there's gonna be the quick build guide at the start then the PvP so the build that I use is a basic natural whack chess piece build from before the uh, new world Aeternum update this chess piece is still one of the best mage artifact into the game if you want to really create a glass cannon build with not a lot of protection like you're losing so, some armor piece to put some fire on this thing but at the end your base damage is just higher so the azot crystal is like an easy base gear to get in this game it's come from mutation m1 m2 m3 and you can upgrade it like you want this one is crafted or dropped but probably crafted same for this spin weave is crafted shamanic i think it's dropped spin weave is crafted and this is another azot crystal piece so i was using the refreshing pillar of fire on my fire staff and i like it i feel like the refreshing pillar of fire i like it way better than the the fireball on my fire staff just because it, it, it popped more often and i put a opal into my my fire staff just to make sure that i add more empower from it then i use the finisher with it you not you don't need to use the finisher it's just that my alt right now don't really have weapon and i don't want to invest in dexterity because i kind of want to put this but at the same time i don't want any point in dexterity because i'm a mage you see what i mean i'm using endless stirs because i'm a glass cannon mage and i use not so much chess piece I don't use elemental ban if I was not a glass cannon mage and I wanted to be more a tanky mage maybe I would go more for like uh, the elemental ban with like a azot conductor or like the nimble coat uh, feeder weight there's a couple viable option of to, uh, if you use the elemental ban but right now my build is not an elemental ban build and I like it like that i'm i'm pretty hard to nullify not gonna lie my empower there's not a lot of my empower that you can nullify bro flame protection it's good against mage spirit like this amulet is basic it's one of the first piece that i need to try to find better uh, i start to drop better you know but um tangle white amulet maybe gonna be the move for me we're gonna see uh, what i'm gonna do so i'm gonna show you the clip uh, I'm gonna say a bit what happened in the clip and my strategy. It's a new format for me, so tell me if I what I should do better or whatever. It's fine. I'm there to listen. So thank you everyone for watching. This first clip right there, you're gonna see it's pretty hard to describe. At the start, I was like, oh yeah, you guys wanna fight, huh? huh? Come here and like they go into the opposite direction and then i was like mm, i don't care i just want to try to one v three them and then this is what happened listen to the conversation into the mic you're gonna see it's kind of funny what's up bro uh, come over here that's something for you bro oh. I'm over here, bro. I got something for you, bro. Hey, hey come, come with your boy, bro. Come, don't come over here alone. You're not enough for yourself.
your friend we're gonna do a real 1v3 all right i don't want to get a free kill like that we're gonna come deeper and we're gonna have a real fight over there all right i don't want to kill you like that oh yeah oh yeah 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 Oh. oh, what's wrong, buddy? What's wrong, buddy? In this next 1v2 right there, you will see me. I apply some burn stack on, my, on an enemy and he's getting really low and he's running away. So just in case that my burn stack are doing the work i'm getting i'm letting him burn away i just turn i throw one spell on the other enemy and then boom i go back on that dude and finish him and you will see it changed everything into that 1v2 they for sure probably didn't have a chance anyway but still it like it just boom finish it <laughs> You need to play close attention on how I aim my fire pillar. Every time that I'm aiming my fire pillar, I'm pressing that key on the side of my mouse. You're gonna see I have a special mouse with one, two, three, four, five key on the side. So when I heal, I can heal all my group. And when I'm a DPS, well, I can use this one to tab target the enemy and it's pretty nice and you, you can like bind more key onto it if you're uh, only a uh, dps but since i'm a healer i don't want to get used to a build and then have to change it all the time so this is why that i, I buy this logitech mouse it's not a it, it's kind of cheap it's between 40 to 70 buck for me it's 70 buck canadian but america i'm pretty sure it's slower that other clip it's the same to dude when i kill someone into the word chat in that area i'm typing gg nice 1v2 come back to the same place if you want your revenge your revenge because i want them to give them a chance to revenge and you're gonna see this time they come in hard and they are hitting way harder than they was hitting the time before they probably buffed up and everything <laughs>
for the last clip, I was just coming back to town and I see two people coming from the bridge and I took the guess that they was into a group and I was like, even if they are not into a group, if I'm attacking them both, there's a good chance that they are not gonna fight each other and fight me. And guess what? It worked. If you made it this far in this video, you are the best. Thank you so much. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Tell someone you love them. Have a good day. Peace out.